Hi everyone, welcome to Battlestar Collectica, the channel dedicated to the stories and memorabilia and collectibles surrounding the Galactica universe. Multiverse Customs is a Etsy company that has been producing action figures for underserved properties like V the Series, Buck Rogers, and Battlestar Galactica. What we're looking at now is their holiday exclusive three pack based on the Living Legend episode called The Raid on Gamore. This holiday exclusive three pack really brings me back to my childhood when J.C. Penney issued those Mattel exclusive sets for one year in 1979. Featuring Starbuck and Sheba in their all black raid outfits, it also has the very first Cylon civilian action figure I've ever seen. Take a look at that. When I first saw the episode, The Living Legend, I kind of was freaked out by the Cylon civilians. It just didn't make sense to me. But I'm really happy we have an action figure based on those really creepy characters we saw in that episode. Next up is the excellent Starbuck figure with double holsters and double colonial blasters. I love his paintwork and I like the idea that the limbs are held in place by magnets. Take a look at that. Very smart. The Cylon civilian has three points of articulation and Starbuck here five. Next is Lieutenant Sheba, which to me is the standout figure from this set. Take a look at that awesome head sculpt and sculpting of the body. They did a terrific job. That really looks like Annie Lockhart who played Sheba on the TV show. Like Starbuck, she has five points of articulation and includes a Colonial Warrior blaster. Now these figures are considered modern retro and they really don't fit in well with what Mattel Toys did over 40 years ago. What Multiverse Customs has done was create their own style, their own modern take on a classic action figure line. And I think it really works well, and they have produced almost every major character that you would ever want. Now, this is a very limited edition set just being produced for this holiday season, and it's available in three different styles. Unpainted, painted like you see here, and even a very retro style that mimics the original Mattel figures with no facial features. So head over to Etsy if this interests you and definitely pick up this three pack before they are sold out. Please let me know in the comments what you think of these action figures. And remember, Battlestar Galactica is far from dead. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a great Galactica day, everyone.